Hello everybody at Compass Primary Academy. Today I'm going to read you a story called The Little Chick and the Secret of Sleep. It's just written me by Maliki Doyle and illustrated by Jill McLean and published by QED Publishing. Little Chick's family were all fast asleep but Little Chick wasn't. She peeked out of the peephole and saw a great silvery moon shining on the river. She followed the moonlight to the end of the river where it danced over the sea. Little Chick hopped into a boat. Maybe I can sleep here, she thought. But when Little Chick tried to sleep, she just couldn't. The waves were too noisy and the wind was too cold. Oh, what's the secret of sleep? she peeped. Follow me, said the moon, and I'll show you. Over the water went Little Chick, till she came to Monkey Island. What's the secret of sleep? she asked the lonely monkey. It's so boring here alone, said Monkey. I never get tired enough to sleep. So Little Chick raced Monkey, and Monkey chased Little Chick. Soon Monkey was soundly snoozing. So you have to be tired to be sleepy, peeped Little Chick. Yes, said the moon, but that's not all. Monkey and Little Chick sailed away from Island of Fire. Hello, said Little Chick to a baby dragon. Do you know any secrets of sleep? No, I can't sleep either. I'm too scared of those big dragon monsters, said Dragon. Little Chick sang Dragon one of her mama's cluckabies till he was deeply dozing. Ah, so you have to be tired and you have to feel safe, she said. Yes, said the moon, but sometimes even that's not enough. The boat set sail to the land of icicles. The wind was sharp, the sky was frozen, and poor little chick was all shivery shaky. Soon the baby dragon puffed up warm air all around her, till she was warm as toast and dozy too. Oh, so you have to be cosy as cosy can be, said Little Chick. They sailed a long way and Little Chick's eyes began to close, but not for long, for there, on Mighty Island, was a herd of noisy elephants. Tra, trum, they sang. They trumpet all night, moaned a tired little jumbo. I can never sleep. Ah, said Little Chick. So it has to be quiet. Well, I know a place that's quiet at night. So she sailed away with her three new friends. You're back, little chick, clucked Mama and Papa. Yes, and I think I can sleep now, your little chick. For at last, she found all the secrets of sleep. You need to be tired. Safe, cosy, and quiet. Thank you, and I hope to see you soon. Keep safe and well. Bye.